Welcome to the School of Mathematical and Natural Sciences, a place where curious individuals are brought together and inspired to explore their passions without limits. Many of our students get to work in research projects that are long-term projects where they actually go and provide a solution and implement and evaluate a solution. Some students, for example, work in the Bully Blocker project where we are trying to identify cyberbullying in social networks. Other students work in the SimCloud project where we are developing uh, big data operators that process large amounts of data to identify specific uh, patterns. And to really make sense of all of this big data that we see, you have to tell a story with these numbers. And so that's what statistics is about. It's about telling the story with these numbers. So one of the really nice things about um, New College is that we have such a strong focus on undergraduate research. We take our students beyond the classroom. We actually continue this educational experience in the lab. So the work that's done in my lab largely focuses on how soil ecosystems respond to various types of um, human-induced change. So that would be things like climate change, urbanization, pollution, biodiversity loss. So some of the students in my lab are doing environmental science research. They're coming up with ideas, we're working together to develop their project, they do it from the beginning until the end, and then they then prepare the communication of that research. Environmental science is doing research on how we can make the environment, the world, a better place. So our lab is focused on the physiology and ecology of charismatic megafauna. So one of our major sort of species that we're really interested in is sharks. Sharks and their relatives, the stingrays and the skates. So today we're at the Odyssey Aquarium in Scottsdale, and this is a great opportunity for my students to really get hands-on experience so they can learn the techniques that we actually take into the field. It's absolutely phenomenal to me. Like, I'm so happy that I'm able to actually make a difference and feel like I'm actually doing something in my field as early and as young as I am. I want to make the oceans a better place than they are now. I want to every day work toward making the oceans cleaner, healthier, and happier for the animals that live in them. I was in there doing DNA extractions, um, looking at DNA sequencing using these really high-tech machines. I was really able to get that real-world experience that I was hoping for. So the DNA research that we do has various types of application, ranging from biomedical sciences to forensic sciences. So biomedical sciences, we tend to look for disease genes. It's like looking for a bad guy in your genome. And this bad player is causing a lot of problems with your health. From a forensic standpoint, you know, we look at human and non-human forensic sciences. For instance, several years ago, consumers thought they were buying meatballs that were made out of beef. But analysis showed that a lot of those um, you know, meatballs contained horse meat. That is not what those consumers paid for. So those examples are how our research impacts real people on the everyday lives. When people tend to hear forensic science, the first thing they think about are TV shows like CSI and Bones. But our students here at ASU learn that you can't solve a crime in a commercial break. Based on the hard work that the students put in in the courses here, they learn that a piece of evidence cannot typically be solved in 20 minutes. It gives them an appreciation for the work and effort that goes into being a forensic scientist. They also learn that the evidence they are analyzing does not determine guilt or innocence. They speak to the truth and what the evidence tells them. The interest in forensic science is growing, and that works because the need for forensic scientists are growing. Our graduates can be that next level of scientists that are helping avoid wrongful convictions, help exonerate innocent people who have been wrongfully convicted. And our graduates at ASU is that next generation of scientists. I chose to study forensic science because I really wanted to use science to help uncover the truth and help those who are involved in civil and criminal cases. When I started here at New College, I really had the dream of becoming a forensic lab technician, working either in a crime lab or in the field. But now, with the experience here at New College, I've set my dreams much higher and will soon be applying to medical school with the hopes of becoming a forensic pathologist. So now, let me show you the place that I'm most excited about being a part of. My research lab. This is the place that changed my life and set me up for an awesome future. The type of research that our students in the forensic science program conduct spans a variety of topics due to the different expertise of our faculty. We have research in forensic biology, 
forensic chemistry, forensic anthropology, and forensic entomology, to name a few. I'm a forensic entomologist, so I work with the insects used in both civil and criminal investigations. And my students are conducting research that have real world applications, and we can use their information to aid in criminal investigations as well as wildlife forensics. So at New College, we have various connections with uh, private and government agencies at the local, state, and national levels, where we can send our students to get hands-on experience through internships. And these hands-on experiences may be paid internships, where they get um, plenty of uh, training in areas that are relevant to their majors. And a lot of these uh, experiences may even lead to actual careers. So these experiences are a fantastic way for our students to put their foot in the door, build confidence, make connections, and pave the way professionally. The students go on to graduate school, they go on to medical school, they go on to professional school or out into the workforce, sort of having this experience that really sets them apart from other applicants um, to the area where they're trying to advance. As educators at ASU, we are not just teaching and mentoring our students, we are creating future thought leaders who can go out and compete globally and contribute to the world by solving problems. I'm so proud to be a Sun Devil. I feel like I'm getting an amazing experience here and I couldn't be happier to be here, honestly. I'm proud to be a Sun Devil because of all of the incredible opportunities that it's opened up for me.